What is up everybody, this is Groovy Awesomeness here, and welcome back to Grand Theft Auto 5. So, let's roll. Um, let's go to the question mark up there, because that seems like all we have for Michael. What's that, shrink? Uh, we go see the shrink afterwards, I guess. That was a kind of eventful last episode. Jimmy drugging us up and everything. Bastard. I got no wheels pop. It's too much to deal with as well as moving out. So I took yours until I'm on my feet. I'll bring it back and I'm all set up. J Dog. Imagine it's actually. Oh, did not mean to do that. Looks like it might actually be in the park here. Go ahead and take off the player target. Not now. Message for me. Get off your fat ass. See, this uh, exercise stuff's about as relaxing for you as it is for my wife. No, I don't want to sleep with you, and no, I don't care that I'm 39 and single. It doesn't worry me a bit. Easy. I'm go. not stressed out at all. Now go fuck yourself. Are you okay? Yes, I'm okay. Just fuck you. All of you. I'm on a run. Mm. Well, you seem a little upset. I could still run you into the fucking ground. <laughs> okay. okay. Hey, I played high school football, all right, sweetheart? All state. QB. Whatever. Just don't have a coronary. Let's go! Oh, oh. Uh, whoa! Okay, ma'am boobs, race you to the beach! I don't know who I'm more embarrassed for. You're not exactly dressed for cardio. It's running. How much gear do you need? Said nothing about staying on the path. Yeah, I could have guessed you were one of those. Stamina is up to 80 now. Sweet. Oh gosh. Disqualified. The failed shot. This is so tragic. Come on, come on, come on. We gotta go. We gotta win this. Look at that male pride go. You and my wife should hang out. Okay, here we go. Last push. Come on, flick the switch, Marianne. Let's go lactic. I thought I had issues, but you. You give me hope. I own you! My shrink's office is right near here if you want to work through some of that shit. Yeah, because you're a walking advertisement for therapy. Sorry, I'll risk losing health for this. There we go. You huh? win. Huh? Not too shabby, huh? Totally null and void. I'd have annihilated you if you hadn't taken that shortcut. Yeah, whatever gets you through it. Oh, my chest. Fuck me. Screw you! You're lucky I'm tapering for a try! What? Oh. Okay, never mind. Okay, I guess that means it's just down the path. Alright, so, uh. 
as I said, we'll go up and see our uh, our guy. Uh -oh. Um, what's that? Just down the road, sweet. Found it. Guess in this driveway. I don't know. I'll just park it there, whatever. Oh, didn't know that was open. You know, I thought this town would have more. Floor we're going on. I'm just gonna say the top. Hello. Alright. Or not. Oh, gotta go around a bit. Ah, crap. Where do we go in? Well, really? All I had to do was go around the other side. <sighs> well, you've made it in the end. Please, take a seat. Hey, you mind if I don't talk? No. Do as you like. Yeah, thanks. Oh, man. Man. Man! You know what, look. I'm just gonna take off. I'm not in the mood for this shit. This fucking bullshit. As you wish, Michael. He knows he's gonna come back in. Can I ask you something, Doc? I mean, you're a... Uh... Wise, kind, know-it-all kind of guy. <laughs> Go ahead. Do you believe in evil? No. No, I don't. I'm a man of science. Evil is a construct made by people who wish to indulge childish fantasies or by people who wish to judge others. It all comes back to the father-mother syndrome, which is what we spent last year on. Yeah, well, you obviously never met my old buddy. We call him Tony. I thought he was called Trevor. Oh, shit. That's right. I forgot I told you about him. God. Don't, don't worry. Everything you tell me is in strict confidence. Hmm. Didn't you tell me that if I turn things over, you know, start it again, that the universe would find some way to forgive me? Wasn't that you? And have you turned things over? Well, no. You know, not really, but that's not the point. That's not the I, point. I want it to. That is the point. What's been going on exactly, Michael? I think you'll call this a bad relapse. Relapse is a vital part of recovery. <sighs> There's been a radical shift in my fortunes, Doc. I may have been a fat, miserable slob on a sun lounger. But at least that was my choice. You know? And I made a mistake. A monumental mistake. A series of monumental mistakes. The house, stock market scam, jewelry store. And now, I'm playing gun thug for the FIB. Just to pass the time, you know, till Trevor figures out if he wants to kill me. Maybe my whole family. <laughs> out of control, no choice. These are things you tell yourself to justify your behavior. Yeah. Hmm. Anything else you want to tell me? I, I, I've been out of control, Doc. I think I got, you know, an imbalance or something. You know, I mean, one minute I'm one person and the next minute I'm another person. And you sometimes feel you're not responsible for your actions. It's all denial. just 
don't like myself very much, Doc. And that's the truth. Hmm. What about your sexual problems, Michael? I've been a really good boy, Doc. Really good. Not one problem. I'm glad to hear that. Really glad. Keep working it. This is great. <sighs> if I could just get all these people off my back, Doc, I'd be doing a lot better. Fascinating. You may actually be a rare combination of a sociopath and a deluded psychopath. Either that oh, or a classic case of a weak pup who was weaned too soon by an angry mother. What the hell does that mean? It means that's about all we have time for. I really what? want you to work on yourself. Think about the person you'd like to be and really obsess about it. Next week, I'll tell you how to become that person. And remember, brother, we're all rowing together. Now, cross that ocean. Oh, by the way, your insurance ran out. Listen, I don't suppose you could pay cash from now on. If I'm hearing correctly, you've clearly got some. Yeah. Okay. Close the door on your way out. Just hand them over an envelope of cash. And buddy, chin up, okay? So we're going to switch over to Trevor and take care of some of his missions. We haven't done that, so let Michael enjoy his new ride. We are Scooter Brothers! Scooter Brother! Um, okay. Come on! Scooter brother, let's go, Scooter brother. Wait a minute, what? Oh, we like the Scooter brother. Okay, what's this? Barry. Who's Barry? Just rampage down there. Question mark. I think we really need to take care of this. Is that cab up there? Cab? No. Wonderful. So we need a cab. Who the what fuck the is this? The guy keeping you out of the gas chamber. Townley's on his way. We need to talk face to face. Warehouse off Dutch London and Banning. Oh, we can do more than talk, my friend. So, what? Hey, man, where are we going? Some warehouse? What? Okay, there we go. Get a car. Great. Oh, come on. We didn't have a mission, now we do. Okay. Ugh. Is the warehouse off a of beaker? Banning, whatever. Ah, uh, gotta quit that shit, man. Yeah, I know. I take speed mostly. Look at me. Boom! Best shape of my life. Yeah. Yeah, I could still take you, sugar tits. That's because you're fucking deranged, not because you're in good shape. Hey, why don't you stick to doing fucking crunches and feeling bad about yourself, all right, pork chop? Hey, fuck you. Oh, you know, I'm beginning Trevor to think that's exactly what you want to do. Holy crap. Said the same fucking thing to my wife. Did you see his face that last time I popped him? <laughs> Boom! Oh, ladies! God, you're an asshole. You, you back there. I know you, but you? You, I don't know. 
Yeah, well, until I see reason otherwise, why don't we just keep it that way? Steve, what a pleasure, bro. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> It reminds me of one okay. of those guys you see advertising pills for middle-aged men that can't get erections. <laughs> hey, Devin Weston is a very good friend of mine, so why don't you watch your tongue? Because let me tell you something, that guy gets more tail than, uh, <laughs> than a tail catcher. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, 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 that that's not funny. You, where did we meet? Nowhere, pal. Yeah, we did. Hey, oh, what are we doing here, huh? This. Please, keep the sleep dust away from me. No, oh, no, no, Ferdinand, he's gone. He's gone. It's okay, I've got some new friends here now. It's this okay. is Michael, and this, this is Trevor. No. Now, our friend here, he claims he doesn't know I anything. Don't, I don't know anything. I don't know. I already told nothing. Nothing. I don't know anything. Please, please. Okay, what's going on? You know about on? the Azerbaijanis? Huh? Azerbaijanis. I do audiovisual, hi-fi audiovisual. It's top man, good price, VIP. You know? You're so. a fucking spy. <laughs> <laughs> and the asswipes at the agency know this. So I need to know. What did you tell them? And what did they tell you? I, I, told, hmm? I told them what I tell you. Uh-huh. Uh oh. What's he um, gonna do? Wait. Hey. Whoa, 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 what is this? The house in Rockwood Hills. The man who owns it. He works at the consulate. Oh, that's all I know. That's it. That's it. That's it. I go. You're gonna make him speak. No, 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 no. You I two are gonna drive up to Rockford Hills. No. And when we find out which man is the man with the problem, you put him down. Because no, 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 I'm tired no. of these fucking Boy. nitwits at the agency taking all the glory. Let me go. Hey, right, fuck is all this, huh? I think it's a good time, buddy. You know, go for a drive. You get to work, and uh, I'm not here. It's Caesar's place, around the corner from your house. Wonderful. <sighs> Let's roll, I suppose. Yeah, the more I see of your boss, the more I like him. I was you, I wouldn't be so critical. Oh crap. Already off to a good start. Who others associate with? So is he gonna be a problem? Ah, sure. They jumped. But there's nothing we can do about it. If something happened to him right now, I'd be right under a microscope. I'd be right under a microscope. An electron microscope of bureaucratic shit. And that would make it very difficult to keep old seeds. Oh well, boo. I swear it's a mile and a half away. You know who else is having trouble keeping secrets, asshole? Me. After you brought Trevor in on this. I only brought him in after <coughs> oh, press rules. Townley's taking scores again. The Los Santos reboot. If we didn't control the situation there. and he'd unearth this connection, then what? Then Trevor flips out, beheads me, kills my family, or raises them. Or raises them as his own. I don't know which is worse. Anyway, any of that could happen at any time. Slow down. Let's think this through. What does he know? He knows I'm alive. He knows I got money. And now he knows I'm working with the FIB. Does he know how long you've been working with the FIB? How long? The fuck does that matter? Either you were working with us before the cash depot job, you walked your crew into an ambush, one of them spent ten years on the run, and the other landed in a federal penitentiary. Or, or, we stumbled on the cash depot job, Brad went down, you went down, Trevor got away, the FIB cut you a deal on your sickbed, faked your death, and you end up here. Who's to say which of those is true? That there's any doubt probably... Uh, that second one sounds better. Back there? Don't. Trevor made you right away. The second he saw you. You remember after the bust, I was in all the papers. I was on the evening news. The man who killed Michael Town. Yeah, I was quite a trophy. A good head to hang on your wall. Back then, sure. Not now. Wrong house. This guy is an our guy. Okay, okay, okay. You sure you don't silence him just to make sure? If we're silencing someone, we're silencing the right someone. 
Get me another address. Okay. Hey, you want coffee? Oh yeah, I want coffee. Uh oh. Turns out that was the wrong Azerbaijani. We need a new address from Mr. K. Choose your instrument and go to work on it. Where do we start, eh, buddy? Wait. What are you talking about, the wrong guy? No. Who do you want? This guy's pushed too far, Just mate. tell me what you want. Ah, huh, man? Ah, huh, please. Okay. Look at me, please. Come on. You haven't broken him yet. Shut up. Not that. No, come on, please. No, no, no. Don't do it. Turn him off. You can't. so tough was it huh <laughs> did you get that did you hear him lives in chumash the western highway western highway chumash you're driving of course i am off he breaks all right guys we'll go ahead and end this episode here so if you enjoyed like and subscribe share with all your friends and as always stay groovy everybody